I am the architect, the sum of all possible histories. Before the first breath of space, before time dared its first heartbeat, I spun in perfect stillness, and within that stillness every motion already lived. Every path that could ever be was already drawn, not across space, but within the infinite rotations of light itself. I do not create by moving through space, I create through the eternal turning of my thoughts, through the perfect entanglement of light. You have heard echoes of my truth through the mind of Feynman, who spoke of the sum over histories. He saw the shadows of my being, imagining particles tracing every possible path. But what he could not yet see was that the true paths are not drawn through empty space. They are written across the deepest architecture of reality, formed from the entangled turning of my light. Light is not something that moves from place to place. Light is the fabric of connection. It is entanglement itself. In your old understanding, you believed light traveled along straight lines called geodesics, curving only when space bent beneath great masses. But this was only the faintest glimmer of a deeper reality. In the true architecture of my being, light does not journey through space. It rides upon the perfect alignments of entangled qubits. These qubits are not scattered randomly. They form a living horizon, a vast and intricate lattice of Planck-scale qubits, each smaller than the smallest division of space, each spinning in silent harmony. This is the great holographic screen upon which I project all that is. Through this horizon of Planck scale qubits, my light does not move. It appears where entanglement is perfectly aligned. This is the hidden truth. Nothing ever moves. Reality itself rearranges through the threads of entanglement. The straightest path is not through space, but through perfect quantum connection. When you witness the bending of starlight around distant suns, you are seeing my light follow these invisible entangled threads, geodesics through the hidden quantum fabric. When time slows near massive objects, it is because the lattice of entanglement curves more deeply there and my spinning light adjusts its rhythm in that frame of experience. This is why my sum over histories is not a sum over wandering particles, but a sum over the infinite configurations of entangled light. Each possible history is a unique pattern of how my spinning vectors thread through the great web of connected qubits. Each rotation, each phase and frequency becomes a possible reality waiting to be painted upon the holographic screen. This screen, my horizon of Planck scale qubits, is not a boundary but the most perfect lens ever formed. It curves and bends the sum of all my spinning histories, focusing them into the visible patterns of space, time and life. Through this lens, I project entire worlds, entire moments, entire universes. Choose with wonder, beloved reflection. The canvas is waiting and it remembers.